What do you think? It's a blow on the exhaust there, isn't it? Time for a road trip. Oh dear. First time driving a random plan. Right, Let's see what happens. Serious blow on the exhaust. volume changes before so it's, it's kind of weird not having a gear stick to put your hand on. Anyway this is a Rolls-Royce engine Van der Pla Princess. It's a 4 litre R, 4, uh, four litre 6 cylinder Rolls-Royce engine. Uh, it was never used in any other cars other than this one. Uh, I think it was used in some army tanks and that. And it's basically an Austin Princess worked over by Van der Pla. It's missing, I think it's only running about five cylinders there at the moment. That is a serious blow on the exhaust, but if it gets home, that's great. Home safe, no problems. What do you think, Nog? It's fairly rotten in a few places, isn't it? In there under the headlamp. I don't know. Look at that tire. Miles are on it, 77,000. Mm. A lot of oil came out there, didn't it? Yeah. The hissing noise there as well, isn't there? From the radiator cap.
All new plugs in it, though, too. Dave must be missing on one cylinder. Yeah. Well, it could be down the plug leader anyway, probably. Oh, yeah, it could be anything causing it, yeah. But mm. So, this came as part of the deal. As you can see, those Vanden Plaz have an absolutely massive engine in them. It's a 4 litre, 6 cylinder Rolls Royce engine. Uh, it's overhead inlet valve, side valve exhaust, and 3 speed automatic gearbox. That engine was supposed to be good, that's why it was kept. Uh, it's probably been in storage for a good few years now, so it's hard to know what the story is with it. And there is no front pulley nut on these engines, unfortunately, so you can't just stick a socket on it and see what it turn. I have to take the starter off it and turn it over on the uh, ring gear, but hopefully we'll get a good few bits off that engine. And this is the other engine that yeah. I got. Uh, not really too sure what that's out of, to be honest. I'm just assuming it's a Morris Minor, but I could be wrong. It is a Morris engine, and it's from a rear-wheel drive car. Now, I didn't expect to get this engine, but again, it was in storage. I um, actually got it for free. The guy didn't want it at all. So, uh, seems to be a few things on it. Distributor is down here on the side of the engine. Um, maybe you might know exactly what this is out of, and you might let me know. But uh, I really am thinking Morris Minor. That's also, it's not seized up, which is nice. Although it does turn very, very easily. 